Thanks, Justin. Angela Kelly is getting into the Halloween spirit. She's in Appleton this morning. Yeah, she's with a pumpkin carving extraordinaire. Hi, Angie. I'd call him that. Hi. Oh, absolutely. I mean, just take a look at some of the pumpkins that you see um, laid out in front of the Radis residence here in Appleton. Um, just a quick look here. You see some stacked pumpkins. Um, this one is kind of, you know, patriotic for the election. Uh, and this one, isn't this fabulous? Donald Driver with his mirror ball trophy. And they actually have um, a rotating light in here. So when it's really dark, you can imagine what that looks like. But here's the deal. We only have one, two, three, four, five pumpkins out here now amongst lots of lights and other decorations. But by four o'clock tonight and through the rest of the week, you're actually going to see 30 carved pumpkins out here. And Kevin Radis is actually working on them in his parents' garage. This is his workshop area. How you doing? Good. I'm great. Good. Why don't you plug in this pumpkin here? All right. And explain what this has to do with the charity you're giving to this year. Well, we have a four-year-old daughter named Brenna, and Brenna became a big sister in May to Kayla. Kayla's delivery was a little scary to say the least. She had a knot in her cord and her heart rate dropped and we needed all of the help of the wonderful staff at St. Elizabeth Hospital. So it was really easy this year to decide that St. Elizabeth Hospital was where our charity was going to be. And the people there were phenomenal and we're just so happy to have Kayla here and for everyone to kind of come see all of our pumpkins and just have a really happy and fun Halloween. What charities have you given to in the past from this event? Last year we did the animal shelter here in Appleton. We've done coats for kids, toys for tots, St. Joe's food pantry. We've kind of tried to rotate every year and pick a different one. So we're really excited for St. Elizabeth Hospital this year. That's fantastic. So, it, but really it is, it's a free event for you to come here. It, you're at your, this is outside your parents' home on East Harding Drive. Yep, we're at 1225 East Harding Drive. If anybody has any questions on how to get here, go to our website, www icarvepumpkins.com. It's got a map. It'll get you right to us. Pumpkins are out tonight, tomorrow night, and then Friday night is the last night. Fantastic. I know you want to give your, your girls a special hello. Brenna, Kayla, Daddy loves mm -hmm. you both. We're going to have a great Halloween. See you soon. Aw, I know they were looking forward to that. Yes. <laughs> hey, great job. Thank great you. Job. Thank you so much. Stick around. Um, Kevin is going to show us a couple more pumpkins you, you can expect to see over the next couple days out in the front yard. So stick around for that. Back to you.